Hey everybody, and welcome back to Kerbal Space Program RP0. We last left Val on the moon, and we're about to cheat a little bit to try to get her home. I hate to do it this way. Yeah, especially considering this... Okay, good, we do have a connection. I'll say we should. We've got enough junk in orbit. Says target. Intercept. One day, 17 hours. So let's see if it gives us the electric charge warning that it shouldn't because it doesn't uh, load those sorts of things for vessels you're not flying. She has the life support for about uh, a week. Seven days or so. So we'll... We're going to play it the cheaty way because I feel like I've been screwed out of enough on this flight. All right, Val, you're up. She still has electric charge. <laughs> oh, thank goodness for gaming the system. Set as target. Uh. Oh. Dang it. <laughs> You did this the wrong way, Val. But at least you've got lots of fuel because we did it all with the uh, service module. And it's automated computer. There it is. Are all four of your fucking thrustings firing? God. Mu mm -hmm. That makes me so angry. Now all of her thrusters work. Now they work. You know what else I'm willing to bet works? <sighs> Kidding me. <laughs> oh, I could have just. Mm. 
Okay, well then. Jeez. Alright, Val, let's just... Let's get this done. <laughs> so... Incredibly over it. are empty. We're going to take absolutely everything that we can from the lander and put it in here. Alright. That's... That's that. Now we can plot to go home. Oh man, we're so off angle though. Uh. Oh no. It's doing the thing where I can't plot nodes again. Which means the game is gonna crash. You know what? Maybe we'll just make Mechjeb do it. I don't usually do this. I really, I don't. I don't like using Mechjeb. They don't still have the return from a moon? <laughs> yep. There it is. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Don't you like that node? We're we're gonna run with it. I'm not reloading this game until this mission is complete. So it's uh it's here on our nav ball. That's all we really need. Undock. Goodbye, you rusty bucket of poo. You almost killed us. All being junky. <laughs> so never using this spacecraft ever again. Thing warrants a total redesign. <laughs> Alright. 47 minutes. What? What? Oh, fuck me. No. I'm not doing this. I forgot Valentina. <laughs> So you know what's going to happen here, right? The game's going to crash. Oh, it did not crash. Alright, so after having moved all the fuel and things around and the life support, yeah, I forgot to get Valentina. 
<laughs> oh, and... God, the most important part. Where's the science, dude? Where's all of the science? I left Valentina in the pot and she died, so I hit F9 because I'm not doing that. But now, oh, there it is. Take data. Whew. I was going to be more than just a little upset if that didn't work. Bored. Now, Valentina is in the correct spacecraft. <laughs> the one that has the life supports. All of them. Right. Well, wow, did I put the electric charge in the wrong one? No, okay, good. All right. Undock. Switch to the one that's useful. Back it away. Do we have a node this time? Hey, we have a node! Would you look at that? It takes us nowhere near where we wanted to be. Oh, thank goodness this worked, or I'd have been really upset. Okay, also... adjustments with RCS once we get closer. Forty-four minutes. Thousand eighty-four. My god. Alright, well. We're gonna be just fine. Well, I appreciate that look, lawyer. I will be here all night and until 7 p.m. Central Time tomorrow. All right. So we've got fuel and spades, a heat shield that is hopefully still attached. Valentina's not dead. We got all the science. This has been an exercise in ridiculousness. Thousand eighty-four. That burn's probably gonna take about twelve minutes, which normally would be about an entire episode of RP Zero. So naturally, we're gonna leave it for tomorrow. Thanks for hanging out, everybody, and thanks for forgiving me for killing Val and then uh, using the reload button. I may never forgive myself. Anyway, thanks for hanging out, everybody. I will see all of you tomorrow. Until then.